Welcome back, my fellow comrades, in a... I think third episode of, of Let's Play Mass Effect 2 with Samantha Shepard and Jacob Miranda. We're about to go and see what the hell is going on on Freedom's Progress. Okay, enough. First, there's the squad. We have two points to use. Where should we put this? Let's see. I can go AI hacking. That will be only one point. That will be only one point. And I can go Reeve or Operative. Mm, big choice. This goes um, vertically attacks the target. Nervous system and Operative allow gives me boost to health. <coughs> Weapon damage. Or I can add Cryo Ammo and AI Hacking. Let's go AI Hacking. And this one point will have to wait. Uh, because for now, that's fine. Uh, fine, fine. Codex, we have freedom, freedom's progress, and investigate the missing colonies, yes. That's exactly what we want to do, no assignments as of yet. Right, so, let's go. Uh, yes, squad points 2, level 6, mission summary. We have a launcher, then some credits, and... Uh, this is, of course, a little overview of the last mission. Time to land ourselves on Freedom's shepherd. Progress. The elusive man put us under your command. Do you have any orders? Hmm. Yeah. What makes you think this investigation will turn up anything new? That's the At big other question. Colonies, official investigators got there first. Sometimes looters or salvage teams as well. We're That's not the first good. Ones there this time. Maybe find clues before somebody else disturbs the scene. As I said in the beginning, in the first uh, episode, as I said, this game has this uh, feeling that the galaxy is much more complicated than it appeared in the first game. And the first game, that was Saren, who was uh, basically the guy after um, he has to, he had his agenda and he was doing what he uh, wanted to do. In this game, it is much more complicated. There are looters, there are mercenaries, that are there is a bunch of uh, different people plus criminals uh, and so on uh, and th this gives us a uh, rather a very good idea of, of how uh, the galaxy works uh, outside of this big political high ground Shepard's authority are you sure you'll be comfortable following my orders we didn't bring you back from the dead just to second guess you commander I the hope so man says you're in charge you're in charge and anything more from the other colonies? Do we actually have nothing we can uh, we can we know about those things? What did you find things? in the other colonies? Nothing. No signs of attack. No corpses. Not even a trace of unusual genetic material to give us a clue. That's not Just good. Just disappear. We've got no target to go after. <sighs> and that's what I wanted to do. We'll work as a successful team, and a successful team is a team that gets the job done. Uh, and that's a phrase that we will, that we already uh, experience in the Mass Effect series and World 2. And we'll hear it much more. We're gonna find out who did this and take them down. Nothing gets in our way. Am I clear? Perfectly, Commander. Good to have you here, Shepard. We have to be pragmatic. Hmm. This colony looks a bit deserted. But electricity is on. Okay. Shuttle goes down. We get out. And let's see. What do we have here? Plus two renegade points. Anything around here somewhere that mm, something might be hidden? Can I go behind here? Yes, but there's nothing. Hmm. Icy place. Seems winter is coming. Quick save. Right there. Understood. With you, Shepard. Looks like everyone just got up and left right in the middle of dinner. This doesn't look good. Things on the tables. Most possibly some enemies will have will be there waiting for us. Oh, good. I have this uh, grenade, grenade launcher and I have my trusty little 
Uh, assault rifle. No, that's not Strange. the assault rifle. No bodies, no structural damage, no signs of battle. <sighs> what the hell is the name of this thing? Uh, sniper rifle. Yeah, that's the one. Like sniping. Sniping is good. What the hell is going on here? No. Nothing. Freedom's progress looks boring, to be honest. We have some parts we can salvage. That's money for us. Let's open this. Uh, one down. And headshots. Ah! What the hell was that? <laughs> this one was dead. I should have recognized us as human. Someone reprogrammed them to attack on site. We're not alone here. That's good, basically, because there means we have a witness or a or the attacker. Of course I know it's a witness, because I can already tell you. Yeah, the map shows us exactly where we should go. Not that I like it like that. That's fine. We can stick to cover. Not much here. No info. Other wall safe. And we can, of course... This goes here. And that's fine. We bypass the security. But not the security of the mechs. This is Medigel. Which is fine. They've seen us. Ooh. Down. Enemy down. And this one's dead too. Cool. Anything here? That might be interesting. Doesn't look like it. People are moving, and we go. Quarians. Stop right there, Fraza. You said you'd let me handle this. Oh. Wait, Shepard. I'm not taking any chances with Cerberus operatives. Put those How do you know down. they are Cerberus? Shepard, is that you? are Tally. Tally, hi. Oh, yeah, this one. Why not? We'll try this. I'll prove it's really me. Remember when I gave you that Geth data tally? Did it help you complete your pilgrimage? Yes. Yes, it did. Fraza, weapons down. This is definitely Commander Shepard. Why is your mm -hmm. commander working for Cerberus? I don't know. Maybe we should ask. Oh, so you do ask me. Fine. Uh, I should be honest with telling. Or I'm not working for them. I'm working. I'm working rather with them. At least that's how we. I'd like this to look. But more or less, I didn't have a choice. Uh, or I did it for humanity. Yeah. Number three. Behind number three is. I know Cerberus has a bad past, but they're the only group investigating these missing colonies. The council turned its back on humanity. I haven't. Yes. Dali, you aren't seriously considering trusting Cerberus? No, I'm trusting Shepard. And besides, we could use the help. One of our people was here on pilgrimage. His name was Vitor. We came to find him. Hmm, yeah. Did you succeed? That's a good question. If Vitor survived the attack, he may be able to tell us what happened. That's the hope. We've seen him, but he might not be in the best state to answer questions. He was injured and uh, nervous around. She means that he was unstable. Combine that mm -hmm. with damage to his suit CO2 scrubbers and an infection from an open air exposure, and he's likely delirious. When Ooh. he saw us landing, he hid in a warehouse on the far side of town. We suspect mm. he also programmed the mechs to attack anything that moved. Uh, that's possible because the quarians are usually good with mechanical stuff. Okay. I. 
there should be a third option here. Uh, we need to team up. Yeah, we'll work together. Vitor's the only one who can tell us what happened here. We should work together to find him. Good idea. You'll need two teams to get past the drones anyway. Now we're working with Cerberus? Shut up. No, I don't Kata, like you. You're working for me. If you can't follow orders, go wait on the ship. Head for the warehouse through the center of the colony. We'll circle around the far side and draw off some of the drones to clear you a path. Okay, but the big question is... You don't trust the, the people with me at the moment. So tell me, why? Your people really don't like Cerberus. What did I miss? They killed our people, infiltrated our flotilla, and tried to blow up one of our ships. That's not how I'd have explained it exactly. It was nothing personal. We can argue hmm. over who killed who later. Right now we've got a job to do. You seem to okay. say that a lot. We work together to get to Vitor. Yeah. <laughs> Jacob, you, you say that a lot. Make sure to keep in radio contact. Will do. Good luck, Shepard. Whatever happens, it's good to have you back. Backs down. For now. Alright. That was Quarians. We need to... Whoa, plus nine Paragon. Wonder. Be careful, Shepard. There's a squad of security drones up ahead. Thanks for the warning. We'll take care of them. Mm. Threat detected. <laughs> that was that was pathetic. That was so pathetic of me. Oh come on! This one here. You have to be also quite quick with this. Because they uh, there's only a second or so when you have, when you can uh, get there okay use overload on them good <clears throat> oh come on that's a rocket drone target down yeah he's dead cool Where, where's the other one? Oh, 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 fuck. Too close, too close. Need to be very careful here. Idiot. We should have expected this. Come on, we can still catch this. Hope so. Quick save. Not, not, not much here. This is quite a linear way. There's not much we can do. The boss fight is almost upon us. What the hell? One down. Oh, I lost it. Where is he? There's only one left somewhere behind me. They have shields. Ooh. They did want to get to Vito first. Get your squad into cover and I'll open the loading bay doors. We'll take right. cover by the doors. Shepard, you take point. Good, you go, go to ground. here, people. Do I have... Yeah, I do have this. I like this more. And now we have a problem. Heavy mechs! This game introduced them as enemies. There were some robots. Fuck. Oh, she's dead. Too close. This is even the red. Whoa, fuck. That mech's got heavy armor plate. Those quarians never stood a chance. This Not is good. Be one tough son of a bitch to take down. Not like we have anything better to do. Yeah, he has shield, armor, and. Health. Overlook, 
Okay. Not easy to kill it. Miranda's down. Now we've incinerate. Incinerate is good for. There he goes. Get up, people. We need you. Yeah, Quarians, like you had a chance against that type of guy. There should be something here somewhere. That was quite easy. It seems uh, my higher level allows me to beat some guys uh, with a relative ease. Power cell, that's good. That's heavy weapons for us. Uh, Where is this? This go. Yeah, one, two, three. This is what? This one's here. And the final security was disabled. We got 3,000 credits. As I said, this money is more important in this game. You have to be very careful what you buy and when. This might be useful. We have heavy weapons uh, that will be researched later. Oh, there's something there. It's cool. Money tally. This is your chance to go find Vitor while I tend to the wounded shepherd. He's probably somewhere in the back of the loading bay. Okay. Tally will do her best. And I won't give to Cerberus everything here, but there are some things I want to do in this let's play that I did not try last time I played. Go, save thing, and a cutscene with Vitor. Mechs will protect, safe from swarms. Have to hide. No monsters, no swarms. Long oh yes, he has a problem in his head. Vitor? No Vitor, not here. Swarms can't find. Monsters coming, have to hide. And um, we don't actually have time to deal with him, this, uh... Hey, I'm talking to you. Hmm. Great. We come all this way and our only witness is a babbling idiot. Haha. <laughs> That's always Storm happening. Storm coming. Storm Renegade Storm. action. Max. Yeah, we need your attention, man. You're not one of them. You're human. They they didn't find you? Not exactly. They didn't find us. The the monsters. The swarms. They took everyone. Yeah, we weren't here. I will try to answer his questions. We're not survivors, Vitor. We just got here. You don't know. You didn't see. But I see everything. You do see everything. Oh, Looks like security the footage. fuck. He must have pasted it together manually. What the hell is that? Ooh. Oh my god. I think it's a collector. Mm, and that was the big problem. First problem. <sighs> Since the collectors were present. Possibly, at least rumors should be known to Shepard. Let's play this with an amnesia. Let's ask what he's doing here. I thought the collectors kept to themselves. They usually work through intermediaries, like slavers or hired mercenaries. If they're involved with the Reapers somehow, it could explain what happened to the colonies. Yes. They don't look good. The collectors have advanced technology. They could have a weapon that disables an entire settlement at once. Mm-hmm. Like this one? The Seeker swarms. No one can hide. The Seekers find you. Freeze you. Then the monsters take you away. We need to ask him more questions. How did you escape? Why didn't the Collectors take you? Swarms didn't find me. Monsters didn't know I was here. The Collectors aren't known for being careless. Maybe his Enviro suit kept him from showing up on their sensors. Or they Most were possibly. using technology specifically designed to detect humans. Only human colonies have been hit. Okay. Seems our biggest uh, problem is at the moment the swarm. Tell me more about these swarms. It's how they find you. Seeker clouds. Machines like tiny insects. Uh-huh. They go everywhere. They find you. 
Then they sting you, freeze you. Sounds like miniature probes, maybe. Find victims, then immobilize them with a stasis field or nerve toxin. Mm-hmm. And tell me more about the collectors. I want to know more about the collectors. Nobody knows much. They're so rare, a lot of people don't even believe they exist. More importantly, mm -hmm. why are they abducting human colonists? What are they after? Maybe the elusive man can figure it out. Maybe. What happened next? The monsters took the people onto the ship, and then they left. Everyone. The ship flew away. But they'll be back for me. No one escapes. I think that's mm. probably all we're getting out of him, Commander. <laughs> yeah, no, that was not a waste of time. I'm quite sure about that. We appreciate what you told us. You were very helpful. I studied them. We have the monsters, a... The swarms. Something. I recorded them with my Omni tool. Lots of readings. Electromagnetic. Dark energy. We That's need to cool. get this data to the elusive man. Grab the quarry and call the shuttle to come pick us up. What? What? Vitor is injured. He needs treatment, not an interrogation. We won't hurt mm -hmm. him. We just need to see if he knows anything else. He'll be returned unharmed. Your people tried uh... to betray us once already. If we give him to you, we'll never get the intel we need. Praza was an idiot, and he and his men paid for it. You're welcome hmm. to take Vitor's Omnitool data, but please, just let me take him. Yeah, he goes with Tally. No argument there. He's traumatized, and he needs medical care. Tally will give us the Omnitool data and take him to the flotilla. Understood, Commander. Yes. Thank you, Shepard. I'm glad you're still the one. <laughs> I'm always Good the one giving there. orders. If I find anything that can help you, I'll let you know. We're ready for pickup. He's not able to give us much more. There is no big consequence of this. Oh, there, sorry, there is a big consequence for giving him to Cerberus, if I recall. But he's not. Um, this is not as good uh, as I believe uh, the ch good choice we did. The Quarians forwarded their findings from Vidor's debriefing. No new data, but it's a surprising olive branch given our history. You and I uh -huh. have different methods, but I can't argue with your results. Yeah. Having friends pays off. At some point it will, but Vitor's, Vitor's data. The data from his Omni tool should be quite useful. We're still analyzing it. But more okay. importantly, you confirm the collectors are behind the abductions. Of course I did. <sighs> hmm. But you don't seem surprised. Seems you already knew that. You only needed a proof. Why do I get the feeling you knew about them already? I had my suspicions, but I needed proof. The collectors are enigmatic at best. They periodically travel to the Terminus systems, looking to gather seemingly unimportant items or specimens, usually in exchange for their technology. So when they do sell technology. Complete, they disappear as quickly as they arrived, back beyond the unmapped Omega-4 relay. Until Ooh. now, we've had no evidence of direct aggression by the Collectors. <sighs> cool. Omega-4 relay. That's a interesting uh, topic. Why is the Omega-4 relay unmapped? What do we know about it? Tell me. Only that no ship passing through it has ever returned. That's Our a best problem. Our guess is that the relay reacts differently to Collector vessels, allowing them safe passage. If they can manipulate relays, that's just further evidence of the connection with the Reapers. Yes, because we know that the Reapers created the relays. And interested in humans. Any ideas on why they've shifted their focus to humans? If they're agents for the Reapers, it could be any number of reasons. Perhaps Obviously, some suspicions. Humanity played a huge role in Sovereign's destruction. That might have been enough to draw their attention. What really concerns me is why they bother abducting the colonists. Once the humans are paralyzed, why not just kill them? Hmm. He has point. He has a good point. He he makes good points, but his methods are usually uh, very risky and not exactly what we would expect. What are the collectors getting from these deals? The collectors aren't very forthcoming about their motives. Generally, oh, that's obvious. They seek out species with rare genetic mutations or abnormalities. They pay slavers and merc groups exorbitant sums to obtain these specimens, mm -hmm. and then they leave. But they've never targeted a single species before, and the previous sample sizes were in the dozens, not the tens of thousands. Okay, but most importantly we have evidence that they abduct human colonies. We have... Uh, we tied them up with this, so it's a safe assumption that they took 
part and they did all of these uh, abductions so the threat is real that's true enough and that means one thing in particular we need to stop them the collectors are definitely a human enemy but how do we know there's a connection to the reapers their focus shifted to humanity only after you and the human fleet destroyed Sovereign. That's the abductions yeah. are related, even if the Alliance and the Council refuse to believe it. I won't wait until the Reapers are on the march. We need to take the fight to them. The truth is, they are already marching. Because <laughs> they are already flying towards the, um, the galactic... Uh, uh, the galaxy. I hate waiting, but I'll need a team. A good one. Oh yeah. I've already compiled a list of soldiers, scientists, and mercenaries. You'll get dossiers on the best of them. Okay. Finding them and convincing them to work with you could be challenging, but you're a natural leader. I'll yes. continue to track the collectors. When they make their next appearance, I'll notify you and your team. Be ready. Oh, I'm a Spectre, true enough. But uh, we we already saw that the Alliance is not about not about to help. Uh, but I had a good team, and they. They were the type of people I need. Keep your list. I want people I trust. The ones who helped me stop Saren and the Geth. That was two years ago, Commander. Most of them have moved on, or their allegiances have changed. Mm, oh good, I have questions about... Mm, Tally, we already met her. What about Tally? She already helped us on Freedom's Progress. That was unexpected. I need more intel before I'll commit to that. Okay, and Rex, the big guy. Where's Erdnot Rex? He returned to Chichanka, and he hasn't gone off world in over a year. He's trying to unite the Krogan clans. So, more or less, he's not the type of guy who will have. He has his hands full. Hayden? Where's Caden Alenko? He's still with the Alliance. Promoted, I believe. His file is surprisingly well classified. So, we don't have access to it. Uh, Liara. Where's Liara Tassoni? She's on Ilium. My sources say that she's working for the Shadow Broker. If so, she can't be trusted. Not true. Your sources are wrong. Where's Garrus Vicarian? The Turian disappeared a few months after you were declared dead. Even we haven't been able to locate him. So they are not available. We must find new people. We already have Miranda and Jacob. I need a ship, that's for sure. Okay, I get it. They're not available. You're a leader, Shepard. You'll get who you need. You worry about the collectors. I'll make sure my team's ready. Mm-hmm. Good, good, good. Two things before you go. First, head to Omega and find Morden Solus. He's a brilliant Solarian scientist. Yes, he is. Suggests and he's singing. How to counteract the collector's paralyzing seeker swarms. Yeah. And the second thing? Sounds good. And what else? Yeah. I found a pilot I think you might like. I hear he's one of the best. Someone you can trust. Oh, I remember this guy. You're the reason I was dead. Commander. Just like old times, huh? I can't believe it's you, Joker. Look who's talking. I saw you get spaced. Got lucky. With a lot of strings attached. How'd you get here? It Tell all me. fell apart without you, Commander. Everything you stirred up, the Council just wanted it gone. Team was oh. up, record sealed, and I was grounded. Grounded. Took away the one thing that mattered to me. Hell yeah, I joined Cerberus. You really hmm. trust the elusive man? Well, I don't trust and now one of the most brilliant They're moments in this bad. whole series, Save in my life. taste. Let me fly. And there's this. They only told me last night. And one of my favorite tunes in the game. Normandy Reborn, SR2. Beautiful ship, perfect for our little venture, adventure, and it's working. <laughs> oh, epic moment, truly epic. It's good to be home, huh, Commander? I guess we'll have to give her a name. Time to see what this baby's got and what can we do with it.
engine screaming. <laughs> oh, my really favorite part of the game. We have the ship back. That means a lot. Level 7, 2 squad points for us, we confirmed that the Collector's Attack Freedom's progress, some credits, and that's more or less what we need.